60 plus seconds of whacked out Fukushima nuclear plant mutations, and a few facts to go with them. The radiation that leaked from Fukushima nuclear plant following the March 11, 2011 nuclear plant fallout caused mutations in many species, from plants to animals. These are some facts they don't want you to know about. Back in 1979, the amount of fuel lost in the core melt at Three Mile Island was about 30 tons. The Chernobyl reactors had about 180 tons when the accident occurred in 1986. Going by the reported amount, Fukushima has nearly 10 times more nuclear fuel than Chernobyl. Or is it more? Here's some facts they don't want you to know. TEPCO very recently before the disaster transferred many more radioactive spent fuel rods into the storage pools. According to the Associated Press, there was, at the time of the earthquake and tsunami, more than 3,400 tons of fuel in seven spent fuel pools, plus 877 tons of active fuel in the cores of the reactors. This all totals up to 4,277 tons of nuclear fuel at Fukushima, at the point of this horrific disaster. So what the hell is this? Kind of looks like a rabbit with no ears. Oh, I got one. How do you catch a unique rabbit? Unique up on it. Ha <laughs> ha! Apparently, this rabbit won't hear you anyways. Capitalists in Japan are now selling clearly discernible radiated, contaminated, and genetically mutated tomatoes. Many reports state that such mutated plants are being increasingly found all over Japan near the disaster area, and even further away. As the capitalists try to draw our attention elsewhere, here are some pictures that I think you'll really find enjoyable. Here we have some Fukushima daisies. A daisy growing out of a daisy growing out of a daisy. I guess we'll call it a Fukazi. And look at this stag beetle. This thing is just the ugliest thing that you have ever seen in your life. It's got one antenna, three legs, probably got like five different sets of eyes, four different sets of pinchers. Uh, anyways, yeah, moving along. Here we have a strawberry that looks like it wants to be a uh, chicken dinner. Uh, terribly mutated, yum, yum, yum. And how about this farmer who has one big ass sweet potato? That's a big sweet potato. And this next one is a picture of a really big yam. I gotta tell you, if miracle Grow doesn't work, just blow up a nuclear power plant. This is a picture of uh, radiation in Costa Rica. Uh, this is a butterfly, and it's heavily mutated. Its eyes are huge, its wings are huge. It's the size of a freaking bat. Look at all the protein in that juicy little bug. Oh, and how about this adorable little frog with an extra set of legs? Well, if anything, two can dine for $1.99's two for one deal. Apparently his eyes are twice the size they're supposed to be as well, but this is the only picture that I could come up with. Oh right, and one last thing. Just wanted everybody to know, one of the pictures that I posted in this video is a fake. Which one did not come from Fukushima? Let me know in the comments section below. And that's a wrap for this edition of 60 Plus Seconds, everyone. I hope you enjoyed the video, and I look forward to seeing everyone again in the next episodes. Thanks again, and have yourself an amazing day. Fast Facts out!